Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Shovel Knight, King of Cards. Last time we left off, we made it here to the Tower of Joustice. And we proceeded to break in and beat up a skeleton boy and this girl right here. And this time, we are going to continue our efforts and see if we can defeat the champion of this particular location. So, where are you at? Is it you? Formless and an infinite are we, we, her legion of guards, liquid samurai. Intruder, by our queen's order, we must settle our scores in justice here. Without a table nearby, our battle cannot commence. So I need to find you a table, I guess. Is there a table over here? No, there's a metal though, just kind of hanging out, oddly enough. Weird. Oh hey, it's Shovel Knight. Don't forget to add it to your deck. I will do that. Alright, who do we take out for Shovel Knight? Um... I mean, Cascade cards are something I want to keep in. Maybe take out the Alchemister? The Alchemister the Birder Bearer. Because the Bomb cards really aren't as useful as they were at one point. Let's take out you, put in Shovel Knight. We finally have the boy himself. Fantastic. Shovel Knight. When are we gonna get King Knight? Where's our card? And what are you, Shield Knight? Yeah. Don't forget to add it to your deck. Well, that's fantastic, but Shield Knight's a really good card. Even better than Shovel Knight, honestly. I mean, Shovel Knight has the uh, shove effect, I guess. So who are we taking out for Shield Knight? Probably another bomb card of some sort. Probably the Alchemister. There we go. Now we got Shield Knight too. We're getting everybody. Steal your tongue. We guard the tower's interest with full attention. Can I steal your table? Is that, is that possible? Huh. Oh well. Guess we can't. What's over here, eh? Hey, I found us a table. If you would get up here. Formless and blah blah blah. Without a table nearby, our battle cannot commence. But there's a table right up there, man. Oh wait, I, I think I see what I need to do. Okay, let's let's walk in here and then walk this way. I think I have to wait for you to get over here. Yeah, chase me, and then bam. Now we have a table. Yeah, for our queen. Neat a little puzzle there, and unlike the blaze orb one at the start, I uh, actually understood this one. So that's good. <coughs> hmm. Just put you there, I guess. Right in the center. Dare anyone to try to destroy you. Well, that's not something I want to do. I could do that. Uh, is there really a point? I mean, I don't have very many other good cards to be using, so... Hmm. That's not a bad move, I guess. I mean, they could very easily just move my card out of the way, but... I think I'm just gonna go with Shovel Knight here. Yeah, sounds good to me. Alright. Ah, I don't have a down arrow anymore, though. That's unfortunate, but it's fine. I can just move this card out. And now we have that. And you... Ah, so many... Having so many of, um... These cards are dangerous. The ones that switch allegiance cascade. It can be a little dangerous, for sure. Oh, you want that, huh? Well... What if I... No, that doesn't work. That does, though. Yeah, go ahead and give me that, please. Thank you. Kindly. Okay, there's your... There's that, there's that card for you. 
Well, I can once again just steal it. Unfortunately, they do have another triple arrow card they could counter that potential play with. Blocked by an opposing arrow. Damn it. I, mean, I could do that, but that would now be his card. Hmm. Could do this and steal this particular space. Yeah, why don't we? Go for it. Polar Knight just kind of dug himself <clears throat> into a corner, as it were. Well, that was a bit of a dumb move on your part. I can just destroy that card now? Or I could do this. No. Hmm. Now that's my card? Uh, sounds like a good idea to me. Go for it. I might not gym sweep this one, but I probably will win, at the very least. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I mean, I might not gym sweep, but... It's definitely looking like I'm going to win, at the very least. What do I want to put down, though? Probably you there. Yeah, I think I should just take most of these bomb cards out of my deck, because they just seem sort of dangerous now. More than anything. Ah, that's an opposing arrow. Damn it. Hmm. Okay, you're starting to scare me now. Never mind, I can just get it right back with Hattie. Sure. Or Mr. Hat. Not Hattie, that's Battle Block Theater. We've been over this before. Hmm. Can't really do anything there. I could push this card out. Not really a lot of reason to do so, though. I mean, if I really wanted to win right now, I could just... He's probably just gonna try to push some things up here. Okay, let's look at his cards. Is there a single play he can make? Is there anything he can push to the right? If I put this here, no. So he'll have to play in that blank space and lose, I believe? Yeah. There we go. King Knight wins. Cool, cool. Thank you, Liquid Samurai. Go ahead and give me that Liquid Samurai Archer, if you would so kindly. Yeah, I find the bomb cards kind of just get me in trouble sometimes, so I might take those out of my deck, especially since I'm starting to get some of these, some more of these, um, triple arrow cards. Oh yeah, I forgot I got Missy in the Dark Acolyte, too. Okay, you know what? Take you out. Definitely put you in. You as well, I don't really find being that mu that useful anymore, so we're gonna take you out as well. I do want an ample amount of Cascade cards and everything, though, and I think I will kick the Dinghy Dropper in, just because since it has arrows on all sides, it can be pretty useful. And there's the Liquid Samurai Archer. Definitely take you out for that, because that's just a better card. Alright, so we have the Dark Acolyte, Missy, and the Liquid Samurai added to our deck now. Definitely getting a lot of triple arrow cards, or count cards, I believe it called them. Either way, whatever you want to call them, they're pretty good. I want that money. There we go. Can I get up there, actually? I can. Is there a point in doing so? Doesn't seem like it besides just getting the money. Hi? You've defeated your rivals, I see. No small feat. You persisted longer than most up here. I do not recognize this character. Now we may finally have a proper match. Are you prepared? Yeah. It's time for you to accept your fate. Is this like the Grim Reaper or something, I guess? Certainly what it seems like. King Knight vs. Horus. Plano Shock? Excuse me? What did that do? I have no idea. Can I see what your ability did? No. Oh, wait. Chrono Shock? 
Oh. Oh, I have to... T I, okay, I don't have as much time to take my turns. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. So I just have to be faster on my turns now. Fine. We'll go quick. That's a nasty ability. Alright, well, let's just... Go ahead and push you down, I suppose. Seems like a good move. Yeah, let's go for it. I don't have time to think. I just have to play this match. Alright. Let's move you over there. And hopefully next turn I can just destroy that card completely. Let's move you out of the way, I believe. Ooh, if I use Shovel Knight, though, it would completely knock you out. So let's do that instead. Not really being able to think about my moves as much is a bit stressful, I'm not going to lie. Hmm. Uh. Okay, sure, go. Just do it. Okay, you have that. Let's see, I could do this. And just kind of push a lot of these out. Yeah. And now you're just going to move down constantly. Oh, that's nasty. That was a dirty move. If I did this, it could be pushed down, which would not be ideal. Okay, I just lost my turn. Damn, not being able to think about my moves is rough. Okay, uh, triple arrows. No, not really useful. How about that? Yeah, let's do that. Okay, that row's filled up, so they can't actually push down to steal that card back. Ah, oh, but damn it, he stole Polar Knight. Yeah, do that. Okay, we still have two gems. This is stressful. Okay, I do believe I just won. Huh. Okay, my heart. <laughs> just having to think really quickly like that, having like a rapid fire game is whew, not good for my heart. Of course I'm going to take Horus, because that is a good card. Oh wow, you gave me a lot of money. Despite all of my posturing, I've suffered defeat. How embarrassing. Dang. Perhaps I'll journey along with you for a time. Some sunlight might do these old dry greaves some good. Alright, let's go. Come join me, Horus. Alright, so that's... Two of the people in the... Joustus. Tower of Joustus defeated. I guess I can get some more money from you. Ahoy, Avenger! 120! It's not much. 900 gold. Are you daft? Yells the carpenter. Too large a box. To lift it, you'd have to be as strong as an ox. The clockmaker thinks, and he ticks, and he talks, and he says, who got time to be moving their clocks? Interesting little rhyme there for me. Is there even anything else to spend my merit medals on? Like, haven't I gotten all of the relics and everything? Ooh, can I can I fight her now? I wonder. I think I might be able to. Didn't she say come back once I defeated everyone in all the Joustus houses? So that might be something I can do. By the tears of the planet, you've done it. You defeated every Joustus champion. King Knight, champion of Joustus through and through. Come with me, I have a new title to bestow. What? If you're to grant me an honor, then kneel before your king and deliver my new title here and now. King Knight, please. The unveiling cannot wait. Are you ready? Yeah. Yes. Reward me for my valor with a fitting title for a king. The first of many, I'm certain. Let us be off. From the depths of your heart, pray. Pray for love. Pray for this planet and pray for ours as well. Uh. What is happening? I'm scared. What is this? Have I transcended to some foul demonic plane? Unveil yourself indeed, conjurer. Uh... Where's my hammer? Okay. Hidden boss? I'm still your friend. You're safe. This is my form in my own world, chosen one. Our scholars foretold of you. A Joustus player who saves our planet and all who dwell on it from certain doom with one fateful match. Okay. Oh, this is totally like a final boss situation, isn't it? Or like hidden boss, optional boss, I guess. 
Well, let's go ahead and get that out of here, why don't we? Oh, you're gonna take my card from me, eh? Hmm. I mean, I could steal it right back. And he doesn't really have anything to destroy me with them, so... Dire dig out? Oh, that's rough. I don't like that one bit. Oh, whoa, you just have all the boss abilities? Is that your deal? Because if so, that's pretty terrifying. I don't like that. Ah, blocked by opposing arrow. Damn it. Ah, damn it. Okay, this, this is going to be hard. I don't have time to think. I don't have time to do anything. I just have to play. Hard to the cards and all that. All right, well, down we go. If you want a match, you're gonna get it, buddy. There we go. Just go ahead and annihilate that. Meteor smash, go for it. I don't care. And... Let's see, I could push you to the right with this. There we go, now we have that on lock. You're probably gonna take it, though, right there. Yup. That is fine. We can handle this. Let's just move you up into the pit, shall we? I'm just- I'm playing so just fast and loose right now. There's no time to think. Get out of here. I can't pay attention to their cards. There's just not a lot to do in this particular situation. Um... Play it. Just, I, I need to put something down. Dire, dire dig out. Oh, that was your own card. Okay. Ah, I put it on one of yours, though. Jerk. Let's see. Yeah, let's go for that. Just having to play quick like this is rough. Okay, we can just put you in a hole. Unfortunately, you'll be able to push me out of the way, but that's fine. Uh, let's see, if I do that... There we go. Let's do that. Oh, wait, no, that was a Cascade card. Damn it, I messed up. That was bad. That- that was me. That was- that was my loss. I forgot that that card's a Cascade. Ah. The- the time limit on my turns is just murder. I think I can do it, though. Okay. So, what do we want to drop first? I think I want to save you, so let's just drop a stupid blubber meanie. Alright. Take that. Just keep trying to swap as many of her cards over to my side as I can. Seems like a pretty good play to make. Oh, is that getting dug out next turn? Is that what that means? I wonder. Wait, I'm not limited on my turns right now. I wonder why not. Huh. Well, let's do that, I guess. Yeah, there's Dire Dire Dig Out, so that is that is what that means. So whenever you see that... Okay, now, now her abilities activate. Good to know. Alrighty. Well, I'm just gonna go ahead and murder you if you don't mind. With my good friend Mole Knight. And if I push you over there... Okay, yeah, I think that works. Unfortunately, yeah, you're going to do that. That's fine, though. We can just push you that way. Man, yeah, this- this time limit is making it so I can't really make good moves. There's just- there's not very many good moves for me to make. So... push you over there, I guess? Okay, that's- that's dirty. I don't like that. Whatever. You're on that space. Fine. Yeah, let's do that. 
That way I can actually push that card off next turn. Let's see. Yeah, move you over. Transmutation? Excuse me? What is what? What just happened? I don't know what all that jazz was, but I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. And I do think they have that completely on... Damn it! Jeez. The limit on my time limit. It's just... It's so rough. I can't... I can't think. I can't strategize. That's like the whole point of a card game. Is being able to think and make moves. But with that, I can't... I can't even do that. And now I'm out of spaces to play anything. Jeez, this... This is a hard boss. And not for reasons that... I don't know, feel entirely fair at times? Because <laughs> I, can't, I can't do anything right now. Like, I could... I could put these cards here, I could do this, but it doesn't do anything. They filled up all the lanes. Hmm. It's like they're using every cheat in the game, basically. And by cheat, I mean, like, the things you actually buy at the shop. Well, there's no point in putting that there. Let's just put you down, I guess. You're about our best bet currently. Hmm. Now's the time where some of those, uh, bomb cards would be useful. Jeez, there's just... there's so much going on all over the map. That might be a good play, as long as they don't screw it up. Okay, we might be able to make something happen here. And he's gonna move automatically next turn onto that space. Ah, the stupid dig out, though! Jesus. Okay, but wait. Oh no... Ah, fuck off. <laughs> All I have are Cascade cards to use. So, I'm just- yeah, fine, I just won't play anything. I would rather not. <laughs> Is there any possible... No. I don't- I don't think there's a possible move for me. Besides this, but that doesn't accomplish anything. There's just... Uh, yeah, I can't do that because of the stupid double arrow. This is ridiculous. And I don't really think I like it. <laughs> just the incredible, like, ass pulls that you can get by having that many of those abilities is like... What, what am I... what am I realistically supposed to do? I'm probably missing very, very, very many moves, but... At the same time, a lot of the time it just doesn't feel like I can do much. I'm gonna keep trying, I guess. No, I want to keep the bomb card just in case. Let's go ahead and do that, and maybe we can get you... So I have to pay attention to when those effects are on my cards, because that means... They're copying one of my cards? Yeah, transmutation means that card is about to be copied. So, gotta keep that in mind. Let's go ahead and just use this to get rid of that card. Completely. I don't think I want you to do that. But I don't really think I have an option. I mean, I could do this. Sure. Give me that. That's my card. Alright, you stole Mole Knight. Who cares? Not really impacting anything with that move. There we go, now that's my card. I'm just trying to kind of fill out the board with my cards, which in itself is even incredibly hard because they can just do that. Put that there, I guess. There's not a lot for me to do currently. They can kind of just change the board whenever they want to suit their needs. It's like, oh, I'm losing? All right, well, let's let's change how things work here. 
All right, I'm gonna go with that. It's really just the time limit. Like, if all the other abilities were in, I wouldn't really mind that much. They're about to copy that card, so let's just go ahead and put you right there. So they got Missy, which sucks because Missy's really strong. Whoa, and you can choose what card to transmutate? Excuse me? Well, that's stupid. Okay, well, take that gem back. Please don't pull out any bullshit. Oh my god, you would. Okay, go. Get over there. Now don't do anything. Just place it in the stupid square. Okay, no. I'm, I'm ending this. Lose, damn you. <laughs> I hate you. Go away. I do not like you having all of those abilities. Jeez. You didn't even put any good cards down for me. Look at you. Where's where's the Cardia card? I'll take a Flary because I don't have one yet. Oh, that was ridiculous. That was stressful. Feat accomplished, King of Cards. I hereby title you Hero of the Ancients. Come with me to my planet. You will save us in glory as our hero. Ha! Huh, what I'll do in glory, my two-faced friend, is rule with an iron fist. Unless your entire planet is prepared for that. No deal. What? How could you? A planet's worth of people, you'd leave them all to their fate? Simply reject your calling as a hero of the ancients? Unless you're ready to become my servants, then I'm not interested. Return to me- return me to my kingdom at once. Impossible. After light years of searching, you would let my planet perish? I'll annihilate you from existence- oh, now we gotta- hmm. I don't like you, lady. I don't like you one bit. I don't like you one bit. Alright, just let it be known. You're a jerk, and I dislike you. Kind of feeling this music, though. So what am I supposed to do to get to you? Oh wait, can I- oh, I have no vigor. So I can't use any of my abilities here. Well then, once again, I ask, how in the world am I supposed to get to you? I guess I bounce off the crystals? Yeah, that seems to be what I have to do. And having no vigor is rough. But I think I can pull it off. Not not playing like this, I can't. What exactly happens if I lose? Do I have to do the like Joustus fight over again? Because that would be awful. Give me that hard, I need it. I can't actually get high enough to do that jump. There we go. Uh, what? What hit me? I tried to pirouette off of your head and it didn't work. Okay. Yeah, send your stupid crystals out. So I can jump to them, hopefully. There we go. Give me that heart. Alright, you're at half health, I guess. What you doing? That one's gonna explode, I guess. That's what they did last time. Oh no, they're shooting at the ground and making shockwaves now. Perfect. How was I not in range to hit there? I, like, bounced off of her face, but nothing happened. I think I just barely didn't reach her with my shoulder dash. I think it was what happened there. Pretty sure I'm dead, like, now. I don't think I'm going to be able to do this. I mean, I'm going to try. But... I don't have high hopes currently. Yeah. Man, actually getting to her is hard. Alright. Round two, let's go. At least I kind of understand your gimmick now. Maybe I can do it. Having no vigor is the... rough part. You gonna shoot the other one at me? You just don't have a lot of time to actually get onto these crystals when she does this little thing where she sends them down. So if you miss it, just screw you. There we go. Give me that. Alright, what was the gimmick with the yellow ones? Okay, jump. Boom. I didn't even need that heart, but I'll take it, I guess. This is dangerous. Ugh. 
No, get the blue one. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, that was close. All right, the red ones were kind of a pain in the ass. How do I get to it? Like, when she sends them down, sometimes they don't come low enough. So it's a bit hard for me to... Ow. And I can't... <laughs> it's really hard to talk and do this at the same time. I might be able to get her during that little swipe, but it wouldn't really do that much damage, I don't think. Yeah, see? Like... She's supposed to send them low enough so that I can actually bounce off of them, but sometimes she's just like, No, I'm not gonna do that. She's actually a smart boss in that she doesn't send her weakness down to you. Okay, there we go. Come here. No, why would you not give me a heart, you asshole? <laughs> I hate you. You know what? Your planet deserves to die. Why are you putting me through this? All because I didn't want to deal with your problems? Come on. I've got better things to do, like play card games. Come on, send it down so I can bounce off your stupid tiara. It's the red ones that are the, like, biggest problem, I find. There we go. There. I might just be doing the jumps wrong. I might just have to time them better, or kind of combo off of all the crystals. There we go, that's what I need. Boom. Give me my heart, please. Thank you. Alright, here's where things get difficult. Are you gonna send another one? No, it, she sent it too low. Damn it. Like, I got hit by the crystal. So now I'm... Now I'm stuck in this. Alright. This, this is totally the hidden boss of the game. Alright, come on. Send them low enough that I can actually jump off them. No, nope. she's like, nah. No easy wins for you, jerk. Okay, there we go. That's what I need. Oh jeez, they followed me back down? The hell is that? No, jump off of them. Oh, come on, the heart was down there, the stupid floating asshole. <laughs> it was just like, I was just trying to get to that heart, but I couldn't. Huh. I don't know how I feel about this fight. Like, it's neat, but at the same time, like... I don't particularly think I like how the boss fight works. I guess, is a good way of putting it. In that you're just bouncing off these things that if you don't do it fast enough, you just get hurt. I don't know how I feel about it. It's not just because it's hard. I wouldn't really care if it was just hard. And a lot of it does seem to be just learning a pattern. Alright, send the other one, please. There we go. Jump. No, that was her stupid chin. Why does her chin damage me? Okay, I managed to- so you can do damage to her when she's doing that whole thing. Good to know. How did- no, that didn't count. Ugh. There's just so much variance in what counts as a hit and what doesn't. You have to really memorize your dash distance. Alright, we have 3 HP, and they have a lot of HP left. I really didn't expect to just get thrown into this. Oh, come on. I, I bounced off of it, but I got hit by a projectile while I was going up into the air. <sighs> come on. Just do your worst. There we go. Wow, I really only had to hit her once. I didn't even get a heart for that. So, just, I just have to dodge here. There's nothing else to do. And that nearly felt undodgeable. I really don't like this lightning one either. I feel like I'm pretty awful at 
getting around that. <sighs> I don't know how many attempts I'm going to give this. I'm already recording way longer than I was planning to. And, I, I mean, I wonder... Oh, there's my headset disconnecting. Stupid thing. Um, okay, can I just restart the fight? No. I took damage on the first phase. Like, we might as well just go ahead and end it here. <sighs> Alright, well... I probably already started cutting attempts out, but I think I'm just going to not speak and try and concentrate and see what we can do now. Alright, this this is a pretty good run right now. I although I, I mean we're seeing new stuff, so I guess I will kinda showcase this one. No, get back up there. Yes. Okay. She has two HP left. This might be the one. Of course the first fight I do after not talking, I'm like, I do great. Ugh, that is so nasty. Ah, she did the little swipe down. I could have got a hit in on her there. I might have won, actually. No. Come back here. I got her. Wait, we both died? No. Does, does that count, please? Did I even actually die, or is this like a cutscene death? Please tell me I still won. No. I'm back here. I got her. Come on. That was ridiculously hard. Please don't do this to me. Don't do it, Shovel Knight. Please, I'm begging you. Get back up, King Knight. Come on. <laughs> Please. Oh my gosh. He got back up. Go away. I don't ever want to see you again. I hate you. No prophecy could foretell this tragic development. I suppose I must venture to other realms to find our hero. I'd intended to give you this as a welcome gift, but I suppose it no, it's no longer required. Card Crystal gives the location of missing cards. When editing your deck, check the undiscovered card filter to learn a card's location. Huh. Undiscovered? Owner Chester. Hedge people? Oh. Okay, so this is how I could complete my card collection. Owner Cardia? Yeah, uh, no thanks. So Chester just owns most of them. But if I wanted to complete my card collection, I could. It's neat that this is... an option. The Homestead. Interesting. So I'm missing quite a few. Alright, well, that's a useful thing to get, I suppose. Now you'll be able to find the location of any Justice card you desire. <sighs> Farewell, King of Cards. Jeez, go away. I hate you. Never want to see you again, Cardia. Ugh. Feed established house champ? Oh, I'm back and well enough. I've had my fill of petitioners for the day. One planet is enough to rule. Pa, the nerve. What is this? Okay, that's a pretty godlike card, not gonna lie. 
You're probably gonna go in the deck. Hmm. Let's take you out and put that in. Alright, what's our other new card? Giga Cardia. Okay, you're... <laughs> you're also fairly powerful. Put you in. Alright. Cool. So those are two of the cards we didn't have. Ugh, get me out of here. Oh wait, no, we can go buy that upgrade, actually. This is gonna be an incredibly long video. Alright. My fancy collection, blah blah blah. Upgrade me. I want it to be gold. There we go. We got new music, too. Oh, I see, um, Horus sitting back there. Just now noticed that. Alright, so here's our gold glide wing. It still has the broken windows and everything. Apparently they didn't see the point in fixing that, but hey. Alright, and with that, I believe we just have two levels left. Yep, we have the final level and the final fight against the Enchantress, which should hopefully be easier than the uh, Cardia was, so... Alright, I hope you have enjoyed this episode of Shovel Knight King of Cards. It may be two, depending on how long this recording is. I haven't seen yet, so... I hope you've enjoyed regardless, and I will see you next time.